Jay Z, that dude, man. We already know that. He one of the illest ones to ever touch the microphone, man. I say about, oh, it gotta be at least over fifty percent. The people who listen to like real rap and all that shit, man. Real bars, real hip hop, man. It's a big chance, man, that they got Jay Z at least in their top five, man. I'm, damn near everybody I know rock with Jay Z. The ones who really listen to real bars and real hip hop, not all that. Purple Kool-Aid, color dreadlocks, skinny pants, all that big gym shoe shit, all that shit with the skinny jeans and the tight coats. I'm none of that, but I'm talking about all that stuff that you know that was official, man. The stuff that we be talking about, man. But Jay Z, man, he that dude, man. Who can he battle, man? A lot of people saying him battling Wayne, man. That'd be a crazy battle, man. I rock with both of them heavy, man. We already know the influence Wayne had on the game. Same thing with Jay. Some will argue that Wayne had a bigger influence on the game, but we already know, man. Jay Z a whole legend. Without Jay, it wouldn't it like wouldn't be no Wayne, pretty much, man. He he like he he came out before Wayne. He been doing it for a long time. He even helped Wayne get his masters or some shit in order, some shit like that, man. Y'all know Jay Z been doing this thing, but can he? Is he actually like the king in the verses, man? I don't know, man. Who can be? Some people saying Busta Rhymes are destroying. Lil, Lil John tweeted that out, man. If you rock with Lil John, you already know he came out at that uh that uh the three the three six mafia versus Bone Thugs. He killed that shit right after Lil Wayne. I don't know, man. Busta Rhymes versus Jay Z though, that shit would be crazy. A lot of Jay Z said can't nobody stand up with him, man. I personally would like to see him go against a bunch of different people, man. Some a lot of people want to course see Jay versus Nas. People were saying, I even said a few people see Jay versus Fifty Cent, man. I definitely want to see that too, man. That'd be a crazy ass battle, man. We already know Jay Z one of the illest ones to ever do it. Some people consider him whole of all of that, man. The goat. You know all the titles that they give him, man. You know, he, he got Beyonce, man. People don't even know that, though, man. People know it, but come on, man. He can. He got the whole beehive pretty much on this side with that alone. Jay-Z can pull a lot of strings, too, man. He got too much money to do a versus battle. He's not going to ever really do a versus battle if you actually ever think about it. It would be nice, though. And if he bring out a few of you know, few people, like, it's like after the... A lot of y'all didn't rock with the Soldier Boy and the Lil Bow Wow versus battle. And I can understand that. But you know, we definitely covered that, man. And they brought out a bunch of people. That was the first versus like to really do that. And now since 3-6 and Bone Thug and really brought that back. Because remember, man, when Dipset battled the locks, nobody was brought out. No, no features was brought out. 3-6. Bone Thugs brought that shit, man. They brought out everybody, man. The whole industry was pretty much out there, man. Even Terrence Howard was out there crib walking and shit, man. It, it was crazy, man. So, that's the new standard, man. People are going to be bringing people out. The celebs, man. They gonna Jay-Z can bring out so many different people, man. He can bring out Beyonce, man. That's it. Instant beehive on his side, man. It's a wrap. Who you going to... It's ridiculous, man. Jay can just do too much, man. Facts.